The gold standard diet is as close to the evolutionary diet of dogs and cats as is practically possible. It is made from fresh, frozen, raw meaty bones, meats, organ meats, fruits and vegetables, minimally processed by mincing and freezing. The diet contains no added synthetic supplements, additives, or preservatives. So that is the gold standard diet that's set in place by the Raw Feeding Veterinary Society. So of course, a whole prey diet that's raw and fresh is ideal because that's what Mother Nature intended. So we want to get as close to this as possible. So I created a cat food reviews list ranking from best to worst within each category of cat food so that you can transition your cat to better and better and better quality food until you get to the ideal situation for you and your cat. Hey friends, it's Jess and Jericho, and a lot of you still ask me what do you think about this cat food brand, so I created a cat food reviews list. That way everything is all in one place. You can see what I think about that cat food brand immediately. The cat food reviews list is based on my cat food label cheat sheet. So this is AFCO's product name rules that I consider here, and then the ingredients to avoid based on Dr. Kruger's website. And then I also take a look at the guaranteed analysis to see how many cars carbs are in the food on a dry matter basis. Ideally, you would have no carbs and very high moisture. Now, my cat food label cheat sheet is a score out of 20 points, but the cat food reviews list air table that I created only lets me do 10 stars. So every rating is out of 10 stars instead of 20 points like on my cat food label cheat sheet. So the cat food reviews list is ranked by category. The first category is raw food premixes because ideally you would make be making your balanced raw cat food at home. And where are you going? <laughs> okay, Jarko doesn't want to be in the video. Ideally you would make raw balanced cat food at home because you control the ingredients and how it's made. Now, unfortunately with homemade raw diets, you might have to use the raw food premix supplements, which would include synthetic vitamins and minerals. But again, it's all about doing the best that you can for your situation, trying to work your way up to the most ideal situation. Then the next categories from there, we have frozen raw cat food, freeze dried raw cat food, and then a dehydrated cat food, wet cat food, and then and all the way at the bottom, we have dry cat food. The columns up top read category. So they're broken up by color, by category. The next column is brand name and company. The next column is the link where you can buy. Then my rating out of 10 stars. Suitable for all life stages means that it's appropriate for kittens, adult cats, and seniors. All life stages. If it's suitable for adults only, it will say adults only. And then the helpful how-to column for the raw food premixes specifically will say recipe and instructions on the website and bag. Down here for frozen raw cat food, I gave some helpful hints like for specifically for hair today, use meat bones and organs plus alnutrin and fish oil supplements and then that would be complete and balanced meal. But for Darwin's, for example, it is complete and balanced as is best to offer a variety of proteins. This video is not sponsored, but there are affiliate links in this list as well as in the description below. And then in the notes category, I wrote whether it's US only or if there's a coupon code that you can use to save money. So best to worst, the best cat food would be whole prey. This is exactly what mother nature intended. This is what cats eat in the wild whole prey, raw, and in its entirety. The next best from there would be raw food premix. So you would make this at home using meat that you get at the grocery store that's fit for human consumption. And again, the recipes and instructions are on the website and the bag of the premix that you're going to buy. Next down from there would be frozen raw cat food that you buy that's commercially available. You know, you buy it on a website. I personally buy Jericho's food from here today. I think that's the easiest because you can get ground meat, bones, and organs, and you use the supplements just to fill in the gaps. If you're looking for something that's complete and balanced, all you do is thaw it and serve it, then Darwin's would be for you. Then the next category is freeze-dried raw cat food. So this you would rehydrate with water. It's very easy. You don't have to use the freezer or thaw it. So this would be great for somebody that's beginning on a raw diet. Maybe your cat's eating dry or wet food right now and you want to add a little bit of raw to their diet. Freeze-dried raw would be very easy. Again, it doesn't require the refrigerator 
for the freezer. You just pour out the amount that you want to feed, rehydrate with water, and then serve. And you'll notice within each category, the ratings are from best to worst as well. After freeze-dried raw, I put the Honest Kitchen here. This is a dehydrated cat food. All of the ingredients are human grade because it's made in a human food production facility and that you add water to rehydrate as well. I actually used to feed the Honest Kitchen to Jericho before I switched into raw. Then the next category from there after dehydrated cat food is wet cat food. And again, this is rated from best to worst within that wet food category. Bye. And then the very last worst cat food would be dry cat food. But again, this is ranked within dry food from best to worst. So you'll see the very first dry cat food has eight stars. And then as you scroll, it will go down and down and down up to five stars right now. But I'm going to continue to add brands to this. Now you may notice that some of the lower categories might have a higher rating than the category above it. With this last wet food row, it has five stars. But then the very next dry food has eight stars. And I do that because at the end of the day, any wet food is better than dry food. Wet food has an appropriate moisture content, whereas dry food does not. So it's still better to feed this particular wet food, even though it has five stars, compared to this dry food, even though it has eight stars. Cats rely on food for moisture, so we wanna feed a high moisture diet. Again, this is ranked from each category, best to worst, and then within the category, best to worst. So just do the best that you can without stressing. There's a magnifying glass up on the top right, so just click that, and then you can type dry cat food and it will highlight all of the dry cat food rows, or you can search by brand. So for example, Nulo comes up right here, there's freeze dried, and then you can click this arrow to bring you to the next entry. Nulo also has wet food, and then you click down to the next one, and Nulo also has dry food. So type in there the brand or the type of food that you wanna feed. If the brand isn't there, let me know in the comments below and I'll add it. Thanks for watching. Jericho, just sit right here. You're gonna be behind me anyway. down.